the Napleton Sports Desk with Sports Director Scott Lever. High school basketball teams are celebrating. The IHSA says it will allow the basketball season to go on as scheduled. Practices will begin November 16th and games can begin November 30th. It was a bold step by the IHSA, but the board of directors agreed that a basketball season could be pulled off and pulled off safely. They cite how well many of the fall sports seasons have gone in tennis, golf, swimming, and cross country, and how well contact days for other sports like football have gone. You know, we really didn't have any um, indications, and, and I don't know that anybody could point to circumstances where that went poorly or you know, cases were spiking as a result of that activity. The decision to go ahead with basketball runs contrary to what the governor and what the Illinois Department of Public Health believes. They say with COVID cases rising, the basketball season should be put on hold. The governor sent out a warning message to the IHSA and its member schools. He said, quote, we've told school districts what the rules are and I think they all know. They would probably be taking on legal liability if they went ahead and moved beyond what the state has set as the mitigation standard. Anderson was asked about the risk of lawsuits the IHSA might potentially face. You know, at some point, I think over the next month uh, or whatever time frame, we'll figure out if this is a legal issue um, for us as an association or if it is for our schools. And then we'll have to pivot as we've been pivoting a number of times uh, throughout this school year. You know, this is a step forward to, to really say that as an association, we. We think we can do it safely, and we want it for our students. Basketball players will likely have to wear masks while playing, and they'll have to distance on the bench. Local basketball players.